In this video, you are going to see how to create a P12 file for uh, App Store under the hook distribution. So this P12 file is needed when you want to distribute your app to the App Store or upload your app to the App Store or uh, uh, distribute via ad hoc which is basically uh, distributing your app to a set of known devices. So let us go ahead and see how to create a P12 file. This is basically a three step process where the first step is to create a CSR file. Let's go ahead and create one. Uh, in order to do this, you have to open your Keychain Access app. And if, when you see the screen, just go ahead and tap Keychain Access Certificate Assistant and request a certificate from a certificate authority. Now, uh, you'll see the screen where you have to give your information. and uh, if you save to disk it is better uh, so uh, proceed so let us save to disk and continue and let us save to desktop yes okay this is how we create our csr or set signing request file okay now let's go ahead and go ahead for our next step which is uh, downloading our cer file or certificate file for this, just open your browser, go to developer.apple.com and uh, go to accounts. Sign into your Apple ID. Uh, provided you are uh, enrolled in Apple Developer Program, uh, you'll, you'll see this option, Certificate Profile uh, Identifier and Profiles. So let's click on this what you see here is the list of uh, certificates which we have already created for other purposes now we are going to create a new certificate so let us click on the add button and we have a list of options to choose from and uh, as we remember we are here for the app store and ad hoc distribution which is here and it is shortly called apple distribution now this particular option is for Xcode 11 or later. You see at this point of time Apple have restricted that uh, we are supposed to use Xcode 12 and later. So for Apple, dis I mean for uh, App Store distribution. So this must be the right option. Uh, whereas uh, if you are doing an ad hoc distribution and not App Store distribution uh, and if you have an Xcode which is uh, 11, I mean uh, uh, earlier than 12, you go for this option. So it is appropriate to go for Apple distribution now. Uh, so continue. And this is where we upload our certificate signing request file, which we have created earlier. So choose file and choose the request which we have created. Search signing request file. Just open it, it uploads to the server. Continue. Now we have created our certificate let's download it which uh, completes our second step right now the third step is to export p12 file let's see now, what we have to do is we have the CER or the certificate file just open it what it does is it adds the certificate to your keychain access app now open keychain access app and go to my certificates so this is where your keychain, I mean your surf, uh, certificate file is added. And what you have to do is, uh, uh, let's pay attention here, where you have to choose both these items, like choose both these items and right click, export two items. So make sure you export only two items, not uh, if let's say you have other uh, certificates over here and uh, Keep in mind that you only export these two items, right? So, it uh, let's say we save it as yes, certificate, right? And it goes by the extension P12 or end product. Let's save to the desktop, and we need to secure it with the password. You see, the P12 contains your sec your certificate details and a private key, uh, which in other words, uh, if you 
uh, if you uh, give this P12 to other people, you are apparently authorizing them to uh, represent yourselves. So it is crucial and I highly recommend you to secure it. So uh, let us enter a password here. Uh, Um, and I will always allow for ease. And this is how P12 looks. It's uh, created today. Now, I just want to uh, mention uh, uh, important thing here, which is that it expires in one year. So usually, when you create an, I mean, when you create a certificate, and uh, what happens is it it expires in one year. So make sure that uh, you make note of it and uh, uh, renew it in one year's time. And that is it for today. And that is how a P12 is created. Uh, if you have any doubt, please mention in the comment section below. Uh, I'll be seeing it and uh, replying back with an answer. So thank you everyone for watching this video.